Was you the first battle rapper to come out as pansexual? As pansexual, yeah. Yeah. Um, I think Rubik's came out as bisexual. No, Rubik, Rubik's came out as gay. He came out as gay, gay first. Yeah, straight gay. Okay. And then he got... he's like, he's um, like um, transitioning or something, yeah, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or she, I don't know. She, I'm, she. I'm, she again, I'm, yeah. I'm saying, I'm not, I'm, I'm cancelled already, you know? <laughs> no, 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 I'm cancelled. This, like, this is like the battle rap thing. <laughs> you hate me, bro. You get no, me? No, you correct me. But as long as you... you, you cause I, bro, I'm not going to lie. Sometimes I do it, man. But uh, yeah, she... Um, Fuck you know. I can't remember. But it's hard I to get my head around, didn't it? Just changing someone from a heat to a shoe. Yeah, yeah. And that's what I said about the um, Shout out them. the yeah. Umbrella Academy thing. Mm. As much as they did a good job in transitioning the the Elliot, yeah. yeah. But like I was saying, yeah, even in real life, yeah, your own brother or sister would mess up and accidentally call you she if you just said, listen. I'm a he now, start calling it me It would take he. some adjusting. Bruv, yeah. it would take a few months, bro. Yeah, yeah, for certain yeah. people to not just accidentally walk in the room and go, she wants it. I'm, I mean, he yeah, wants yeah, it. Do you yeah. get what I'm saying to you? So I had a, I've got a friend that had a, um, I can't remember which, I can't remember which way they went, but they had a, a, a sibling that had transitioned to the opposite gender that they are. And, um, and yeah, it, she told me, as my friend told me, that it, 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 it takes like, it does, it did take a while. But then, but then once you become adjusted to it, then when anyone else ever gets it wrong, they're the first ones to be like, no, you can't say that. Because obviously it's their sibling, isn't it? So, yeah, man. It is, a, it is I get what you mean. Like, it is, it is quite well, it's a... it's natural uh, to make the mistake, isn't it? And yeah, that's yeah. That's why I think the writing was a bit poor in the sense where everyone was a bit too perfect about it, in my opinion. But it, well, with what? what with, Umbrella um, Academy. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. yeah um, so, yeah, when you, you came out as pansexual, but mm-hmm. that's what I was trying to ask. Like, what does pansexual mean? Pansexuality, basically, if, like, to put it into, like, so simple terms I can, is um, it's just uh, the, uh, the attraction to someone without without gender, if you know what I mean. So it doesn't matter what gender they are. It's about the, like, the person. Obviously, like, looks does come into it, right? But you're not. So what's the difference between pansexual and, and bisexual? Uh, bisexual doesn't include non-binary, trans... It just says it, bisexual okay. is just men and women, so it doesn't include the middle, the middle ground. Okay, okay, um, okay. I think that's the best way I can put it. Um, I didn't really. I'm not going to lie to you, brother. I didn't really understand it. I just knew I was different from quite young. I didn't because a lot of people say because the the, the the term I heard was like pansexual means that you love someone for who they are, not because of their gender. Yeah, essentially. And then that made me question like if you aren't saying like because obviously you can say you love someone for who they are regardless of their gender. Mm-hmm. And they could be a man or a woman. Mm. And then, obviously, when pansexuality first come around, I'm thinking, so, outside of a man and a woman, who else is there? Yeah. Do you get what okay, I'm saying? so, yeah, yeah. So, I'm thinking, is this, is this directed at kids and stuff? That's why I, I oh, may have no, come no. across... No, but that's why I came <laughs> across... Um, do you get yeah, me? So, then, so now, obviously, th- there's... People are starting to identify as all different genders and things like that. Uh-huh. So now it makes more sense. Now you've said that. Do you get what I'm saying? Because yeah, yeah. at first I thought it's the same as bisexual. They, they, but yeah. they're using loopholes to say other people, if you get what oh, I'm saying. Oh, no, yeah. But no, man same. didn't really get it. You get of me? Of course, but of course. It's, that's um, why I wanted to have the, the actual chat with you as well. Because yeah, people always, I know they see us taking the piss out of each other and that. But <laughs> yeah, yeah, no. We're boys it is actually, yeah, it, yeah. Yeah, it's, all, it's all blessed. You get me? So it's like... <clears throat> Man, I would rather understand and have the conversation. And for it, sure, bro. Yeah, yeah like, I mean, I'm, it's good for people to, you know, ask the question. You don't learn without asking, bro. So I don't. I, I feel like when people jump down people's throats saying, oh, if they ask something that they deem stupid, and they're like, oh, well, you don't know that. What the, you know, you need to you need to get with the times. It's like, bro, how can people get with the times without asking a question? Because well, uh, someone's just asking in a respectful manner, and you know what I mean. And you don't, you know, of course, get any like put anyone down. And you know, what I mean? of course, because another thing that I was asking like, at the time, like. Um, so I remember, obviously, yeah, Toucan came out as bisexual, bisexual yeah. a few years ago. And obviously, he was with his missus at the time. He came out as bisexual and then proposed to his missus. Yep. And obviously, you was with a woman at the time when you came out as pansexual. So I was, yep. again, I said the same thing at, at the time. And people was calling me ignorant. People were cussing me. And again, but I just said, like, why would you come out? whilst you're with a woman if, if yeah. that's the woman that you plan to be with forever or whatever mm. then what does it matter who you're attracted to other than her you're her sexual it was it was said, you get what i'm it saying it was said woman's idea for for me to to come out openly with it i mean i've always considered it but it was a it was a conversation that we had had at the time and um she's the one that um 
uh, encouraged me to do so. And I mean, all personal things aside, it's um, it was a good decision because it was a good idea. And I, I'm glad I did it. Yeah, no, because like obviously this is I get like what I was questioning is uh, in a normal like regular because we're kind of semi famous. Yeah, <laughs> in a regular person's <laughs> life. They might just decide to be gay, but pansexual, by it, whatever, mm. and not feel the need to make an announcement. Of course. You yeah, know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, so, so I was kind of thinking, you're in a relationship, you're making an announcement. And the thing is, when I said this to Toucan, he said to me he was getting blackmailed to do it by a rapper, mm. a battle rapper I've that he's done this. stuff with. Oh, jeez, I didn't yeah. hear that. I just heard yeah. yeah. Okay. And I, I, I've got my suspicions. But really? he was he was being blackmailed by a battle rapper who he's done stuff with, basically saying, if you don't tell everyone, I'm going to bring you out. And uh, um, I don't, I don't know if you know who the other, but did, did the other person come out as well or no? I don't think so. That's no. mad, crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's really bad, bro. <laughs> That's bad. Like I think outing someone or forcing someone to out themselves is a horrible thing to do to someone, man. Because it, it is. Up I to could them, be obviously. misquoting. I could be wrong. No, I've heard Tukan something similar, up, but I think that was the conversation. Yeah, I've heard. Tukan. I've heard something similar. Um, not. As but as you said as well, your ex encouraged you to. do Yeah, it, so. so it's because Rubik's got such a bad reaction. Um, okay, so you and like I was like, "This is bang out of order, bro." Because yeah, we, he's not alone. Like back, yeah, see, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, uh, it, it, I thought it was bang out of order that sh she was getting such such hatred from from our community, like battle rap, when she's not alone. So when then LSD did it, and I was, I think, I think it was very soon. Because like, I spoke to LSD, and I was like, "Oh, bro, like this is how I, I feel the same." Blah blah blah, and then boom, it all because it, it all happened in the same day, and I think it was just a bit of a, a thing for us to be like, "No, we stand with her." And then, yeah, because me and LSD got shown bare love. Like, literally, there's only about, I can count on one hand how many people. Like just because gave me you're shit. more popular in the battle rap community. That sucks, though, know? man. It doesn't matter. But like, I who's feel more like popular. Rubix was probably getting shit from the outskirts of the community, the people who were never really accepted anyway, the viewers who leave hate comments maybe, on, maybe, on everything. Maybe, maybe, yeah, because yeah. there's always been the haters in battle rap community. Yeah, the, but yeah. if people are in the community that actually, like, I think that's what people fail to see. And that's the thing. That's why I hate when fans jump on bandwagons. Yeah, yeah. Because same. they don't get it. Like me and Shotty will fall out. We'll have an argument, threaten each other, see yeah. each other and hug each other. Yeah, yeah, straight. Do you yeah. get what I'm saying? But the fans don't see that. They don't see us hugging each other. They see the me and him arguing back and forth for a hundred comments. Uh, yeah, and they, and they think you're like and morbid start, enemies. Yeah, and then they start thinking, oh, Shotty's my guy. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? So it's the like bandwagon is definitely like, yeah, it's, it's that's mad. It is a, it, like... So maybe, yeah, maybe you're right actually, but I just see him getting uh, her. Sorry, Jesus Christ. I uh, keep seeing her getting um, a load of shit, and I was just like, this is a bit of out, bit out of order. I mean, I, I don't get me wrong. I, like, if there's a hundred battle rappers that reacted to my my coming out, four of them gave me shit. I'm not gonna lie, yeah. No shame was fucking hard, mm. but that's what first threw me off. Like, rah. Yeah, the fuck, yeah. You get me? Like, this is mad. But you get me, since then, like, I think No Shame, I don't even know what the fuck No Shame wants to be identified as. I, mean, I swear, like, I, I don't know. they have titties, they've got kids, like, I don't know. I'm what not going to lie, I don't really remember. I know the name and I know their, but, their, but, uh, they're them. Yeah, no, no, no. I, I, like, again, No Coast, um, you get me, in a couple of other leagues, I think. But, again, that's, that's, it's come a long way since then, do you get me? Course. Like, it's mad how that was such a thing, and now you've got, in America, you've got, like, Prison Battle League run by Sarah Connor and that, in it, actual LGBT Battle League. Oh, really? Shit. I didn't know that, really? Yeah, yeah. Oh, damn. Look they got up, them. Bro. That's sick. I didn't um, know that. There's a guy who got in the Crucibles, I can't remember his name, J something. J2. J2. He's, he's, he's gay, isn't he? J2, yeah, 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 yeah. So he comes from that league. Um, yeah, there's... He's a, actually there's, sick as well. There's a whole league, man. Um, Sarah, you remember Sarah Connor from um, Team Homie? No. I'm saying you ain't battle rap. <laughs> yeah, you ain't no. battle rap. Man. I was about to lie. I, mean, I, I, I you can't know who even Team Homie is. Yeah, I know Team Homie is. Yeah, so yeah. Who's I in know. Team Homie? Hmm? Who's in Team Homie? PH. Yeah. Rest in peace. Yeah, rest in peace. Uh, is it Lex Luthor part of it? Or no? Nah? I think he might have been stopped. Yeah. I don't know how long that lasted, though. You know, I'm I'm right on off top of my head. Sway, of course, yeah. yeah. Sway, yeah. Sway, yeah. There's a few of them still. What's you know the what? Money bags. It's cause, it's because it, I haven't I haven't seen that name thrown about anymore. So like, mm. you know, I, I kind of I do remember Team Homie though being a presence um, when I first started watching. I think a lot of Zayn's Team Homie. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Um, but yeah, so they, that's the thing. That's another thing for you to look into, isn't it, man? Yeah, um, that's prison, crazy. Like, prison battle league, like really prison, like the rainbow team. Um, oh, prism. Yeah, prism. Sick. Yeah, yeah. Um...